PCs. They can change the way you work, play, learn, do your shopping and keep in touch. If you haven't got one yet, there's no better time to be thinking about it. And there's no one better than time to help you. Computers can seem a bit daunting. So whether you're buying your first PC or upgrading an old system, stay with us as we explain some of the jargon and tell you everything you need to know about buying your very own PC. It's amazing what you can do if you've got a PC. Everyone in the family will want to do something with it. But how does it all happen? Well, let's see what a PC actually is. This is a typical time computer system. This is the monitor. It's pretty much like a TV screen, but of a much higher quality. It's through the monitor and these speakers that the computer communicates with you. So how do you communicate with the PC? Well, this is the keyboard. You use this to give instructions to the computer and to enter information. And this is the mouse. When you slide it around like this, it moves an arrow on the screen. When the arrow is over the item that you want, you click the button on the mouse to select it. Now, this is the main part of the PC, the case. In here are all the components which make it work. All these components are known as the hardware as opposed to the software, which are programs such as games and office packages, encyclopedias, design tools and so on. So what goes on inside here? Let's take a look. The power and performance of a PC is really down to three main components inside the case. First, there's the processor. This is the main engine of the computer. There are several types available from different manufacturers, such as Intel and AMD. Processors are measured by their speed, how quickly they process information. This is measured in megahertz for each type of processor. The higher the megahertz value, the faster that processor will be. The latest processors have extra 3D features to speed up games and multimedia software. Next is RAM, which stands for Random Access Memory and is measured in megabytes. This is the memory that the PC uses when it operates or runs programs. With more RAM, you can run bigger and more powerful programs, and also more programs at the same time. Software will load faster, games will look smoother, and file saving and picture printing will be quicker. Then there's the hard disk drive. This is where all the software programs and the work files you've created are kept. The larger the hard drive, the more data you can store. Hard disk drive sizes are given in gigabytes that is, thousands of megabytes. If you think of a PC being like a human brain, the speed of the processor controls how quickly you think, the amount of RAM determines how much you can think about at once, while the size of the hard drive dictates how much you can remember. There are other components inside the case, and we shall look at some of them later on. So that's what goes on inside a PC, but what can you do with it? Whether you want to work from home, manage your money or create professional standard colour documents, with a PC you can make everything come to life. And don't worry if you can't type. With the latest voice software, just say what you want and your speech appears as text on screen, without you even touching the keyboard. Time PCs arrive with all the software you'll need already installed. With enough RAM, you can switch between programmes at the touch of a button. What's he up to now? The games you can play on a PC are really stunning. To get the full effect of the best games, your PC needs something else in the case, a 3D graphics chip. This has its own memory, also measured in megabytes. Now, for many games, you'll need a joystick like this, and some games work better with a gamepad like this. For added realism, though, how about a steering wheel for driving games?
CCs are great for education and research for people of all ages too. This is a multimedia encyclopedia. And this is DVD, the best way to watch the latest feature film releases. All PCs have what's called a ROM drive on the front, and they play discs like this. There are two types. DVD discs produce brilliant picture and sound quality and can store complete movies. There are plenty of major titles now available. Larger games and encyclopedias also come on DVD. Other PC systems may have a CD-ROM drive instead. CD-ROM discs look identical, but don't actually store as much information as DVD. They're the standard for the huge range of encyclopedias, leisure titles and games released to date. If you have a DVD system, you can also play standard CD-ROMs. And whichever you have, you can also play normal music CDs as well. And of course, all PCs have a floppy disk drive like this. So you can make backup copies of your work or exchange data with other PC users. Using the TV Out facility on some systems, you can connect your PC to a television so that everyone can watch a film, view your pictures or join in with the fun of CD games or internet browsing. Many time PC systems are fitted with a TV card so you can catch your favourite programmes or replay videotapes without leaving your desk. The TV card also allows you to record video clips and store them for later viewing or for use elsewhere. What's this? Ah, the internet. She's shopping online. With your PC, you can get onto the World Wide Web and visit millions of websites anywhere in the world. To do this, you need a modem. This is a device which sits inside the case. There's a wire that comes out of the back and plugs into a normal telephone socket. The speed of the modem determines how quickly it can send and receive information. This is measured in kilobytes per second. You then need an account with an internet service provider such as Netline. This gives you access to the internet, some space to build your own website and your own email addresses. Some charge a small monthly fee, whilst others, like Netline, are free. Then you just pay for the telephone call, usually at local rates. Your Time PC comes with software already installed, so you can set up an account and start surfing right away. Look, she's getting her email now. Email enables you to send and receive messages with PC users all over the world for the price of a local phone call. And you can send and receive pictures and documents as well. And download all kinds of software from other computers over the internet. Using the modem, you can also fax your documents to a standard fax machine, whilst the voice facility on many modems allows your PC to work as an advanced answer machine. And if you want to talk to someone face to face, how about a video phone? This uses a camera and your modem to communicate with other video phone users via normal phone lines. You can also use it to take still photographs, just like that. Then you can email them to your friends and your family. To get the best out of everything, you'll need a good quality monitor. This is a normal 15-inch screen. But if most of your usage will involve creating graphics, going online, playing games or watching movies, you should opt for a larger 17 or 19 inch monitor. Well, those are just some of the things you can do with a PC. Let's look at some more. With a printer, you can create exciting cards, pictures and posters all in full colour. And you can print out homework projects and reports. This is a scanner. You can take any picture or photograph Scan it into the computer, change it, merge it with other images, graphics or text and then print it out or send it to anyone with an email address or fax it to a fax machine. The scanner can also be used as a photocopier and the character recognition software means that you can also scan printed documents into your word processor to save typing. You can also get pictures into your system with this, a digital camera. Take a snap, alter it in a paint program and print it out. Using special photo paper, you can get photographic quality print, like this, from most inkjet printers. There's no need for the cost and delay of traditional developing. The picture's yours immediately. These are just some of the things you can do with your own PC. So if you're thinking about buying one, let's see what you need. The processor, RAM and hard disk drive are the main components of the PC. They govern the overall performance. 
If you want to play the best games, a processor with 3D features and a 3D graphics chip will be important. You need to decide whether you'll be happy with a CD-ROM drive or if you want the latest DVD drive so you can watch movies and use the new generation of software as well. You'll need a modem if you want to get on the internet. A video phone will let you make face-to-face -face calls and take stills and a TV card will let you watch television and videotapes on your computer. You'll almost certainly need a printer. Most time PC systems include a full colour model in the package. A dual cartridge printer with separate colour and black cartridges is the best value. Finally, a scanner and digital camera are great for taking pictures and then downloading them into your computer. Well, so much for the hardware. But a computer is not much use without reliable and versatile software. Time PCs are loaded with a vast range of software as part of the package. So let's see what you get. A word processor lets you create and edit letters, reports and other documents. A spreadsheet can help you to produce accounts, business plans and make all sorts of complex calculations automatically. You can compile, store and search banks of information in a database. With the presentation package, you can produce brilliant and creative visual material. Desktop publishing and drawing software helps you combine text and photographs to design cards, posters, newsletters and even magazines. Using a computer-aided design or CAD program, you can design your own garden, home or office. And a personal money manager helps you to plan, budget and forecast your finances. Educational software is important too. You can learn languages such as French, German or Spanish much more easily with speech and spelling prompts built in. Encyclopedias and atlases provide a wealth of information for homework and projects. GCSE, SATs and other curriculum software can help with exams and revision. And there's a huge range of lifestyle, home and hobby software available. But with so many options and extras, how do you choose the PC that's right for you? Well, it pays to take some expert advice. Time is the biggest PC retailer in the UK and has stores all over the country. You'll almost certainly find one within 15 minutes drive from your home. There, you'll be introduced to our very latest range of PC systems. There are systems to get you started, systems for serious games players, home, office systems and the ultimate Time PC for those who want the best of everything. Time stores only sell PCs and you'll find that our staff are friendly and approachable experts. They'll help you choose the PC system that's right for you. In the unlikely event that you're not happy, Time's 14-day satisfaction guarantee means that you can exchange it for another. To help you choose the most suitable and up-to-date specification, Time publishes a free PC buyer's guide every month, which gives advice on the latest technology. It lists clearly what RAM, hard drive capacity, processor and other components you should look for to meet your particular requirements. And how do you know you're getting a good system? Well, this is Time Computer's head office and factory in Lancashire. Every Time PC is built to order here in the UK using state-of-the-art, reliable and recognised brand components. Because Time both make and sell their own PCs with no middlemen, costs are lower. This will save you hundreds of pounds and ensure you get the latest technology supplied direct from their factory to your home. You can be confident of Time PCs. Time have won numerous awards including all these Best Buy awards in the past year. They also publish a review brochure where their latest products are independently reviewed by the leading PC magazines. Your PC is rigorously tested and comes with the assurance of a 12-month guarantee. It's also guaranteed not to be affected by the so-called Millennium Bug. Every time PC also comes with software to keep it problem-free and working at peak performance. Backup CDs of all software are also included. To get you started, there's a setup leaflet user guide and a comprehensive Windows 98 tutorial specially written for your Time PC. You'll also receive an hour-long video training guide which shows you everything from connecting the hardware together to operating the software so you can learn at your own pace. 
And if you need any help after that, Time offers dedicated telephone hotline support where you talk directly to Time, the people who made your computer. With the optional Time Cover support packs, even higher service levels are available to you. This can include the remote support package, which, at your request, allows Time support staff to take control of your PC via the telephone line and to fix any problems which may have arisen. When you buy a PC from Time, we're with you all the way. For expert and friendly advice, manufacturing of the highest quality and for ongoing support, you can trust that Time is on your side. We hope we've shown you some of the fun and benefits of a Time computer system. If you'd like more information, visit your local Time store or call this free phone number. And remember, if you're thinking about buying a personal computer, isn't it time to make it time for your new PC?